we are one of the first few companies in the world who have really adopted uh, Dolly from Databricks so soon. Its performance is almost as good as what uh, an OpenAI can do, which is a much larger model. We currently have more than a million products on our website and more than 10 million pages on our web page live at, as of now. For the last three years, our team of data scientists, our data engineers, all of us have been working very hard and we've been trying to uh, build a portal which can essentially read thousands and millions of reviews across millions of products and figure out what are the specs of those products, the pros, the cons. A product can have uh, somewhere between 100 to 5,000 reviews and a human can't review everything for each product. Databricks has made it very easy. They have sort of created a full integrated pipeline. You can use the lake house to store the data, use Databricks to do an ATL, find out your relevant portions of, of data, give it to a large language model, fine tune that large language model, use it there. All that flow could be monitored uh, within Databricks framework uh, with ML flow to manage everything. We started using uh, 3.5 to generate text to find out features in our models. But then of course there are some limitations for OpenAI models. Our major one big concern was our data content security and the second thing was the costing and third thing is the performance because we are playing around with a huge data so it has to be quick and fast. We tried with the Dolly and uh, Initially, the results, to be precise, they were not good. All the models are being trained on different mechanisms. You have to fine-tune it. Once you fine-tune it, the results were exceptional and uh, far beyond our expectation. Shortills have been kind of highly enthusiastic in trying out new technologies. Uh, the day uh, the new model comes into market, we are, I believe, we are the first of the customer of using these kind of things.